John totally did in bed next to you. John, ah! there's two million. Oh, there's two million. What's going on? <laughs> the lights just flickered. Check or to give us our letters. She has no idea we can see her. Their house, guys. Big Brother game is full of tough decisions. Here is another big one for you. In front of you is beautiful, heartfelt letters to your house guests from their dearest at home. Oh my God. Are we gonna see her shredding our letters? You will also find a check made out to you for the sum of $5,000. You can either take the money and shred the letters from home or you can shred the check and give the letters to your fellow house guests. Holy f <laughs> if I take the letters and give it to these friggin' people, Kenny would cry. Oh, Kenny would cry. This is still a lot of money, and at least I'd leave with some money in my pocket. I can't talk my way out of. I can't talk my way out of this friggin' situation. Take the money. Take the money. Don't take the money. Don't take the money. Don't take the money. Do not take the money. And the worst feeling with the friggin' shred that five thousand dollars could help me and my family for people who would just send me home regardless. But if I shred these letters, I no big brother. They're gonna open up that friggin' thing. And they're gonna see that I shredded all their f letters and I got my check. Oh, I hate every single one of y'all in there. Except for you, Adele. <laughs> if I choose to give them their letters, maybe it will soften their hearts and they'll f keep me here. Oh, big brother. Big brother, thank you so much for this. Thank you so much. I wish they were out here so I could freaking bribe them and tell them, listen, if you guys keep me and swear on your damn dogs and your family and your kids, I'll give you your letters and if you let me stay and send Heather and her broken foot on out the door to Arissa, Gary, and Peter and the world. I'm looking at all their names and they all want me gone, with the exception of Adele. Rochelle, f you. I could care less who wanted to write you a freaking letter. You just got one, bitch. It's okay. Sabrina, goodbye. Neda and Adele are the only two people who'll vote to keep me here after this. Okay. No. <laughs> they'll read it, they'll feel bad, and Andrew will convince them that it's a letter. She did this for us. It was nice. She should have taken the money and oh well, too bad. That is what Andrew would say, because you're an ass. You're an ass. Because he doesn't care. He has no heart. He does not care to get a letter from home. He doesn't care. He would say, oh, nice letter, but you know, if I were you, I would have taken the money. And I would have to freaking knock his ass out. Because you have to hold me back, okay? But Kenny might have a heart. I just don't want this ass getting in your ears and taking you away from your good heart. The one that cries, that would feel bad for me and keep me here. What he wouldn't give, what he wouldn't give to get a letter from home, from his sister. Would Kenny change his mind and keep me here? Cause it's, this is the, Kenny runs all these people. Kenny has Rochelle, Sarah, Andrew, 
right here wrapped around his finger. That's pretty much how the game is. Would they, would he keep me? Oh my God, I really, really want to keep these letters. I do want to keep these letters and hope it will save me. What a woman. She's going to do it. What a woman. She's going to do it. <laughs> what would you do? We'll find out what Ika does right after this. Welcome back to Big Brother Canada. Ika is faced with a real moral dilemma. Take $5,000 cash or let everyone else in the house read a letter from home. Let's see what she does. What a woman. She's not gonna do it. She's not gonna do it. No, she's not. No matter what I do, they, they're not going to keep me. They're not going to keep me. Such a dumb bitch. Oh, my God. No. That was my letter. Oh, that was funny. Oh, yeah. Bitch. So. Here I go. Oh, my God. Sabrina, bitch. That's me. You came in here, f***ed up my game. Goodbye, good riddance, you. <laughs> you, the mole. Be gone. Oh, Arlie, you could go. You could go, honey. You don't bring the letter. You could go. John, I'm sorry. Sorry. Oh, Heather. Girl. Netta, I'm sorry. So sorry. Telltale sign right there. So sorry. Adele, I'm so sorry. Don't be sorry. I'm so sorry. To you. It's okay. It's okay. It's all good. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. Don't be sorry. Dude, is she out there? Oh, yeah. She's still laughing as she shredded everyone's letters. Well, you're sending me home in two days. What the hell do you care? Don't talk to you me. You you're sending your me home. Game? Get out of here, Kenny. Oh, Turn shut your away. serpent mouth. Not. You bitch. Get the out of here. You heartless Bitch! Oh my god, I cannot believe that just happened. Like, I actually am stunned right now. What did you hear me contemplating? Like, can you choose to? Everything. Every single thing? Everything. They're in this corner dying of laughter on the floor, slamming each other. What else is she supposed to do, though? Honestly, like, let's be honest. But what Adele and her laughing and... We all turned against her. 
But do you think what I shredded, the chocolate would have kept me here anyway? No. One billion for that. Five grand. At least I got five grand. Of course. She's f***ed. She's going home 100%. She got five grand. She made the right decision. I just think it's so mean. Everything she said about me was 100% true. <laughs> I turned my back on her. I f***ed up her game. I'm proud of it. I'm not saying what she said was right. But the thing, the inner thoughts that we have in our own mind that we don't think are being shared are a lot of times way harsher than what they are in real life. It's going to be a rough two days, though. I don't care. 